Hello and welcome to week two of house renovation updates. We've not done a whole lot in the front other than bring even more rubble and stuff out. So come, come in, come in, come in. Oh. We've had some major proper renovation things. So first things first. I went where the wall was. So the wall is gone. That was a good day. That happened a few days ago. We knocked the wall out. Actually, we took it down very carefully because we're reusing the bricks. So this is blocked up currently because we've got some holes in the wall. We've got a few bricks out behind here because we're in the process of taking the bricks out for this because we're getting the French doors in. I thought I would come outside and show you anyway. So underneath here, there's only one layer of bricks now because they've been taken out. To block up this door, which is gonna happen on Monday. And we've rebuilt the outhouse, which is gonna be the utility room. Uh, you probably won't be able to hear this, but this is what they've done. So this, that's why the back door is blocked up. Um, it's really, really windy outside, so we're not gonna go outside. This is the upcycling room. We started to brick up the chimney, but then I realized that the chimney sweep hasn't been yet. So the chimney sweep's coming on Monday, so I had to tell the bit, oh gosh, okay. Um, I had to tell the builder to stop bricking up the chimney because the chimney sweep needs to get in there first. Lights arrived, so we've got the light for in here and the electrician came in yesterday, so come and look at this. This is just one example. We have working plug sockets now. We have chopped back plug sockets. So they, the electrician put all of the plug sockets in the house now because before um, all of the plug sockets were big boxes stuck on the side of the wall. So now the electrician has chopped them all back in and put them flush to the walls. So that's happened all over the house. Have we done much upstairs? Oh yeah, let's have a look upstairs. Also, I've taken off the panels on the, oh God. Taken off the panels on those doors. In here, the plumber came and has taken out the boiler. So now we've not got a boiler um, and the old cold water tank. So. On Monday, this wall is getting knocked out. So this wall will not be here. On Monday, it's gonna go back to how deep this is. And then the shower tray is gonna go straight across here. And I'm gonna go and order the bath, all of the bathroom stuff I'm gonna order next week so that we can get on with doing that and get rid of this peach suite, which is gonna be um, a really sad day. So that's that. Looking here. They chopped back in all of these light sockets. Oh, we've taken up loads of the floor. Um, this had lino and also hardboard on with about seven million nails. So we've taken all of them up. Um, one thing I did want to very, oh, that's a bit squeaky, isn't it? That is what I wanted to address. I've had a few questions about why we're not keeping the wood floors but I'm getting everything carpeted. Purely from a practical point of view, I mean, it's just very squeaky and more echoey. And from a real estate day-to-day -day point of view, lovely wooden floors would be really nice, but not in this house. It just, it doesn't really fit. So carpets are more of a real estate thing. We've got some new plug sockets over here because this is obviously second bedroom. So we've got two double sockets. This will be blocked up on Monday as well. We've got a lot of things happening on Monday. It's the back of the bathroom wall, so this will be flush on Monday, hopefully, and then I'll be able to decorate in here. So that's this week. Oh, let's have a look in this room. In the bike room. So we've now got an actual internet socket and normal plug sockets in here. 
So we'll take this wardrobe out and then this is going to be where my bike is going to go. My turbo is going to be here. So I'm really excited to have that in. Um, this will realistically be one of the last things that we decorate and get fully organised. Actually, let's show them from above because I don't really want to go outside because it is so windy. Out of the window. Get right out there. That's what we rebuilt. They took the concrete roof off and rebuilt the walls and that's going to house my utility room. The only reason he wasn't able to put the roof on yesterday was because it was so windy so the roof just kept getting blown off. And yeah, that's pretty much it for this week's update and same again will happen next week. I hope you're all enjoying these videos. Um, I've got an Instagram for the house and I will see you in next week.